academic mission that we are doing this week is to support the next generation with new experience with the industry. We believe in the best cocktail between freshness and expertise and this is why we co-create uh, this community through the mentoring that we offer and through the creative games. The purpose is to uh, get early users using the software and test it. They will be able also to be disruptive. To bring new tools inside the industry is always well seen. In the other end, they are able to witness how we are developing a software. I think this kind of workshop is really important for uh, a young designer. They break the ice for the students in, towards the industry. And we want to take the fear away for them. It's like, hey, don't worry, you are a talent. Be proud of how you think. I think that model is a great tool to, uh, to emphasize in the first um, stages of a, of, a, of a design. Especially the VR part of things is a really smooth experience of exploring new things and it boosts your creativity way faster than that you used to be uh, when you just do a sketch on paper. Also in combination with the other tools of, uh, of uh, Adobe like uh, Stager and, and Painter and Sampler. We try to really limit the technical barrier and then of course there's that seamless transition between working in VR, spatially, seeing your design in front of you, grabbing it, and then going to the desktop as well. It's really cool to see them go from struggling to really getting into it and, and making something. The idea was to model an AR or VR headset. So we had to implement, in a way, the technology of VR and AR into a problematic that we were totally free to choose. Since we were new to, to the software, we to also have uh, some freedom to you know, experiment and have fun in the software. So we found the, um, the topic of uh, forensics. We, we thought that it would be quite hard to dive into a new software in one day or two days. I started the stager just today and we already made uh, something that we found pretty nice. Uh, the initial idea was to, to help rescue workers uh, do their job better in the future by using AR and a drone uh, to kind of detect people or problems in a, in a hostile situation. is a completely different way of working. I think in the early stage of design, it could really help people to, to move on quickly with the design and quickly in 3D because it's, it's much easier to, uh, to model something quickly in 3D than switching to CAD. Switching from desktop to VR can be good because in VR we have a really good approach of global volume and everything. What I love the most with the Adobe software is that we can really switch from one to the other. We can go from sketch to the 3D and to the render quite easily. The whole creative vibe to create for two weeks straight was uh, really cool. Yeah, and uh, the added value is that we have uh, opinions outside of school on our work, so it's really beneficial for us. I'm just happy that I could use the software in a better version and to have all the help here, so yeah, makes it great. <laughs>